episode my first YouTube milestone, which are the 500 subscribers. And as I promised, by the time we reach this goal, I'm going to share with you for free an Excel spreadsheet that incorporates my FS, aka forward step method, staking plan. I've talked about it a lot in my previous videos. I've made two playlists where I show and explain the exact procedure and the formulas behind it. I've helped many of you to create it by yourselves, and you showed me great re results with that. Uh, but for those of you that are not that good with basic Excel commands, or for those that are bored of trying by themselves, I'm going to give it to you for free. So please, if you haven't sub subscribed yet, please do. So today, I will analyze a bit how our algorithm, and when I say our algorithm, I refer to the Google Sheet that I share with you, so how our algorithm is doing during summer. Firstly, I want to say that I'm very happy that I see more and more people following it every day, and by now you're around 40, 50 people that are always checking it. So for the past two months, I've stopped playing football leagues. Right now it is only Brazilian leagues and some other, but I don't bother running the algorithm for these. Meanwhile, we're getting ready for September to start strong with football. For the Euro Cup, as I said before, we don't have sufficient data for the teams and it is a no bet situation in general. So what are we betting on? We're betting on baseball, MLB, which has matches every day, hockey, NHL, but there we have only playoffs, so not many matches to bet on, and basketball, NBA, that are soon over as well. The plan is to keep finding 3-4 matches to bet every day, spending minimal effort and charge our batteries for September. But wait, even by doing this, we still have 52% profit based on the algorithms and my UBM, aka Ultimate Betting Method, that I showed you in the previous videos. Even those 40-50 people that are using this for free during summer, with only 3-4 matches per day, are still in profit because, as you see, we find the value our heat rate is bigger than the odds percentages. Okay, so let's go a bit deeper into that. Uh, we've seen up to now that we we started with 2,846 units, let's say, but 4 euros. And uh, up to now we're at 4,335. So that means a total return of investment, 52.31%. Uh, we have uh, 714 bets, as you can see, that means that we have like 2.09 um, euros, let's say, per uh, profit per bet. Uh, we have around 8 bets per day, but this is not the case because at the beginning we have a lot of matches, football matches, but after a while we have like 3 or 4 matches um, per day. Uh, so we have 714 bets, as you can see. 397 wins and 317 losses. Um, we only have, um, um, as you can see here, a value. We, we find the value uh, 0.56%, which is not very big, but we find the value. Uh, so if you just play one unit per game or um, just a flat stake, you're going to be winning. Uh, but as I said, in order, this is just especially um, to be in use with um, the UBM method um, and uh, we're not trying to find the, the optimal value, the best value we can. Uh, we're looking specifically for average odds between 150 and 170, 180, I can say. Uh, those are um, those um, odds that uh, fit better in our uh, UBM method. So we find the value and this is important. Um, the football matches, uh, at the beginning, we played 404 matches, we had 52%, uh, but we aim for bigger odds by then. Right now we have, um, we aim for smaller odds, so when we start this 52 is going to be uh, 65 according to training. So we're looking for 65% hit rate. Um, when I started following basketball, we aimed at the beginning for 65 and we managed to get 68%. Uh, as you see here, we find the value, uh, we find 6.13% value. Uh, at football, we had only 0.6% value, but still there was value. Um, in hockey, we have only 97 matches, 
And as you can see, we don't find the value and we're minus, but uh, most of the matches here are playoffs. So um, the algorithm, of course, is not working as it should because it's playoff. So it's the data that we have are not coming from playoff. We get the data, the training data from <clears throat> a regular season while we're betting on playoff. The teams generally are not the same. Uh, but anyway, um, we use it in combination with other matches and other leagues, other sports and other leagues, so it doesn't matter that much. But baseball right now, this is the one that uh, during summer uh, it makes our profit. We have 178 matches um, in a league that gives us 10, 12 matches every day to pick from, and we find three, four matches every day. So we have 60%, as you can see here, hit rate, we have a yield of 6.35%, which is really, really good. And um, we, in the end, it will be like 65. This is what, what we want to have. Uh, and the average odds are 1.71, which is exactly what we want to feed our system. And we have the value here is 1.71%. So uh, this is exactly as we planned uh, at the beginning. So if we go a bit under, below here, you can see that the final days, uh, let's say from Sunday 27, we have a serious run over here of wins. Uh, so even if you use the, the initial FS method that I'm advising to play doubles, so like parlays of two, um, you're gonna have like many steps. So this can be one step, another step, another step. So you have many, many winning steps to close your FSs. Uh, if you use them, and play flat stakes, you still, you're still winning, of course. But if you use the UBM method, you see how it goes. Um, you see that the odds are not big enough, but we find the value through that, and they fit perfectly FS and UBF methods. Um, if we go a bit here, you see that we have some losses, wins and losses, but a big run of wins is coming and we cover everything all the time. Look here as well. Um, so th this is a proof that this, this thing was working up to now, even with minimal effort, with minimal everything. So let, let's go to the Excel file, which is the same as the Google Sheet, but just uh, it's going, uh, the Google Sheet is getting the data from, from um, this Excel Sheet. So we can go to this portfolio over here, so you can follow and see how um, money-wise um, our bankroll goes. So it started from 300 and it goes up. So it goes up and down, up and down all the time, but then it goes up, up and down all the time, then it goes up, up and down a bit, but then it goes up. So um, this is um, this is how the Google Sheet is going. It depends on the money that you bet. This is just a an example, but those are the matches that I play, as I told you. So uh, this is something I can maintain, I can I can give you picks. Um, those are the same things that I play, so this is how it goes. Uh, so I have this portfolio tab over here that you can see, that I analyze every pick that I play. So we have basketball, football, hockey, baseball. Um, here we separate the picks, if it's home team to win, draw or away team to win and the value for each one, the profit that we have from each one, how many, how much money we, we staked on, on each uh, result, the average odds, um, everything is here, the yield, everything is here, how many bets, how many wins, losses. And then underneath, we have the leagues, the name of the leagues that we play, MLB, uh, Finland, soccer, football, uh, NBA, Sweden, all the so everything is here. As you can see, all the leagues that I've played and I've bet, and the analysis of each one. So, what are the bets? Um, so, everything is coming through um, formulas that refer to the table that we have here, the logbook that we, we have. So, by doing this, we see where we find the value mostly, uh, where our profit is coming from. Uh, and this is something that every better should do in order to be able to analyze the results and see what um, you should bet or not. Uh, then I have another tab uh, here, round balance. So this tells us every day 
how many bets we have, um, how many wins, losses, how many active bets we have. And um, you can see here a graph of every day uh, and the bankroll, of course. And um, here we, we analyze how many winning days we have, how many losing days. And um, here you can see the win percentage for every day, the bankroll, the pro profit for every day, and then the bankroll every day. And here is the percentages that the percentage that goes down or up uh, or bankroll every day uh, regarding in comparison to the previous day. Then I have another tab over here. I call it pivot. Um, so it, it says ex exactly the same thing. Uh, but this is a pivot table. Um, and uh, for example, if I click here, uh, this is, uh, let's say this one, it was uh, yesterday's matches. You can see that I bet on NBA one match and I, it was 168 the average odds, decimal odds, of course. And uh, I had a profit 73.62. And then MLB, I had two matches. I won 140 on um, uh, units, let's say profit, and it was 162 the average odds. Uh, and the same thing can you can see in every day. So this pivot table is a very good way to see what you're doing every day, if you have profit or not. Those days were not profitable, as you can see here. Uh, anyway, another tab. To analyze something more, RVO, this is very, very important, uh, especially if you're betting flat stakes and you're trying to find the value, um, you see where your algorithms goes better or not. Um, so I've uh, divided the, the odds into um, uh, decimal and only 0 0.1. So you can see I, I have the odds, I analyze the odds from 1.3 to 1.4. Here 1.4 to 1.5, how many bets in total I've made and if I'm winning or losing. So as you can see here, I am, I am especially, because I use UBM method, um, I am especially for 1.5 to 1.8, let's say. So here is the majority of my bets. And um, between 1.5 1, between 1 and 1.6, I've gone 2,000. And between 1.6 and 1.7, also 2,000, while between 1.7 and 1.8, we've lost uh, 700. So this is how it goes. And here's a graph where I, I find the profit. This is, uh, I think, the most important uh, if you're uh, aiming for the value and you, you don't aim for a specific uh, odd range. So this is one of the best things you can do to analyze your betting. Um, so that's it. And that's the same, of course, Excel, you can have FS or UBM that calculates everything. So this is one of my uh, UBM, as you can see here, um, tabs. You can see it goes as uh, far as I want. Anyway, um, that, that was it for today. Um, I hope uh, you follow, continue following this. Please subscribe again because we, uh, it will be good if we reach the first milestone, as I said, 500 subscribers. I will be able to share as a gift to you the first FS uh, method, um, this Excel that uh, will make your life easier. And then we see, we can discuss how you can make a logbook like this. We can discuss more about algorithms. I'm also preparing this PDF um, that will teach you how to step by step how to fix your first algorithm. Um, that will be successful, of course. Um, anyway, good luck. I hope you enjoy your summer. Um, you have a nice vacation. Enjoy the sun. Enjoy Euro. Enjoy matches. Enjoy your families.